Hi guys, my name is Puma Donsela and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are doing part two of statistics and this is um, on grouped data. So this is an extract from a past question paper and it was in question two. And the question was saying, Elena did a project on climate change at two each day that she recorded the temperature in degrees Celsius for a certain town. The information is given in the frequency table below. And then uh, we are given the temperature in degrees Celsius in intervals, and then we have a frequency for each interval. So what we are required to do is to calculate or is to determine for how many days did the learner collect the data? So that is 2.1. So 2.1, how many days? Since this information was recorded on a daily basis, we are required to add each of these numbers and this would give us 30 days. 2.2 says write down the model for the, the model class for the data. So model is the number that appears a lot. So this is the one that appears a lot, nine. However, we write this one as the model. So we have 28 less or equal to time and 32. 2.3 says estimate the mean for the data. So what we do here, this is why I extended this table here. So you must first find the midpoint of the temperature. Then you must multiply this midpoint with that frequency. So how you do it is that we will do for the first one, we will say 20, which is the minimum plus 24, which is the maximum, divide by two, this would give us 22. So we do that for each of these, we say minimum plus maximum, divide by two. So here we will get 22, next one we'll get 26, next one we'll get 30, next one we'll get 32, uh, sorry, 34, Next one will get 38 and the next one will get 42. Then we can now bring in our calculator and we say 22 times two give us 44. So we write 44 there. Next one is 26 times four that gives us 104. Thirty times nine gives us two seventy. Thirty four times five. gives us 170, 38 times seven, gives us two, 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 six, six. So we have two, six, six. Then the last one is 42. So 42 times Three, one twenty-six. Okay, one twenty-six. So what we will then have is that the mean is equal to the sum of f times x o over n. So here we must add forty-four, one o four. 270, 170, 266, and 126, all divided by 30. 
and our estimated mean. We bring in our calculator. We'll put in our fraction and we say 44 plus 104, 104 plus 270 plus 170 plus 266 plus 126 all over 13. And that gives us 32.67. Okay. 32.67. Then 2.4 says, calculate the percentage of days on which temperature was at least 28 degrees Celsius. So here we want the, temp the number of days where the temperature was more than 28, right? So we'll go to our table and we'll say okay let's start from the bottom this is more than 28 that is more than 28 that is more than 28 when you look at these two here 28 is not included here 28 is included which means we will say that percentage of days is equal to 9 plus 5, plus 7, plus 3, all over 30 days times 100 because we are looking for percentage. Then we'll go to our calculator and we'll have 9 plus 5, plus 7, plus 3, all over 30. All of that multiplied by hundred so we get 80 percent so 80 percent of the days this temperature was above 28 degrees celsius that brings us to the end of our session if you like the video please click on the like button please share with friends and also don't forget to subscribe for more videos until next time toodles